guys, a biscuit bro here, and today I'll be showing you guys a cool mod for Terraria. Uh, it worked for 1.3 right here, and you can see it was last updated yesterday as I'm recording this. So yeah, um, it's very up to date and stuff like that. Uh, basically, what it is is a uh, mod that's online based, where you can spawn in any items you want onto your character, and uh, yeah. So uh, basically, what you can do is you click load right here, and then it'll show all this. You just go ahead and click whatever thing you like or this one of these player files whatever you want I'm gonna go on to let's go on this guy it's my character I made just for this and uh, yeah he already has some stuff in his inventory as you can see right here but let's just go over all this so right here we have the character uh, health you can actually increase this by a lot if you want I, I can put a million on it actually I'm gonna do that let's just do that Okay, mana, let's also put that up to a million. And I'm not sure, I, I'm pretty sure this is going to work. I've actually never tested it out before. Uh, I don't actually think I went over a million. Yeah, I actually went to a billion, I think. Anyways, um, you can change the character to male or female. Hair style, you can also change that. Fishing, quest, complete, I can put 49. Right? To get 50, I can get that golden fishing pool. You can also add an extra accessory right here, so that's pretty cool. Clothes style, you can change it up. Uh, hair, this, uh, oh, you have to change the number thing, so, like the code for each uh, color, so yeah. Uh, equips, this is basically this slot right here. Uh, you can change armor, accessories, here's the extra slot for expert mode, ammo, uh, coins, so yep. Yeah. Next we have miscellaneous, which is like the pet lights mount uh, hook. So yeah, and minecart too. Here's inventory. You can change a bunch of stuff here. Uh, bank. It's like the safe. Or no, this is a piggy bank right here. Put whatever you want there. Safe. Uh, it's the safe they can buy from. Or bank and safe you can both buy from the merchant if you haven't known that. But yep. Worlds. Uh, I don't think. Not exactly sure what that does. Buffs. You can add a bunch of buffs, I guess. So I guess I can add, let's see. Oh, yeah, I can add a bunch of buffs here. I actually never looked at this, but. Yep, so I can add this. Reduce damage taken. I have to change the seconds to forever, basically, because that's longer than anyone's ever been alive, or probably even humans have existed. But anyways, uh, yep, so, okay. I can change that long. Or you can just make it try and make it infinite. I don't know. Yep, that's that. And let's go back to inventory and show you what I can do here. So let's say I have. Let's just get a weapon really quickly. Oh, yeah. Let's go over the library. So here you can search whatever you want. So I have a meow mirror. There you go. Terrarian. Right here. So yeah, search whatever you want. Right here. Up uh, here's materials. We have pre-hard mode. Uh, all this stuff here. Let's just list off materials by what they're crafted with. Uh, go back here. Uh, hard mode. Uh, nebula vortex. Uh, solar. Sort of all that stuff. This is the lat. Uh, luminite and Martian stuff. A lot of things can search through here. Uh, theme or yep, themes, ice, all that stuff. Uh, wood crafted stuff and also granite stuff yep decorative they have some decorative stuff here a lot of this is more self-explanatory of pets here choose all the different pets these are all the lights and i think this i think it's a yeah some of these there's some few mounts in here i'm not sure why but yep we have pets um we can spawn the turtle we can spawn dog lizard egg all that stuff mounts here are all the mounts you can have right here um potions these are all more regeneration potions for like healing potions mana potions all that stuff and these are all the potions with effects on them so i can put uh let's see this potion if you want and it teleports me to a party member so yeah uh, here are the events this is basically just spawning things so we have quite a few of the spawning things actually uh, almost all the things you can use to spawn the bosses in 
We also have the events here. We have like the solar eclipse, pirate invasion, snow globe, goblin invasion. We can spawn impending doom. Uh, Naughty president, pumpkin moon. Um, I think these are all the things you actually can spawn in. Here, here's a cool slot. Um, all the quest fish. So basically, like every day, you can like, or yeah, every terraria day, you can just put all the stuff into your, um, into your inventory, and then like whatever he, you, whatever the aggler wants, you just give it to him right away, and then you can reload your inventory, whatever you want to do with that. Uh, categories. This is like different categories. You have weapons, equipable tools, placeable walls. So like weapons here have melee range. They have all organized out. So we have melee, range, magic, and summon. Uh, equipable stuff: armor, accessories, vanity, head slot, body slot, leg slot, dice, wings, and hooks. And tools, placeables, walls, all that good stuff. And uh, I think that is. Oh, items by ID. You can go ahead and look at that if you want. Oh, uh, yeah. But it's probably a lot easier using all this stuff. And yeah, that is that. So I'm just going to get a sword really quickly. Uh, whatever sword is fine. I'll just get a gold broadsword. And I can give it any buff I want. I, all right, here. So I have a gold broadsword. I can. Uh, this is a little bit sorted out differently. Or not differently. But it's also all sorted out. So we have best. Uh, damage, this uh, uh, critical stuff, we have positive um, buffs and then negative buffs. So yeah, uh, let's just go and put a legendary on there since it's a sword. And uh, yeah, so now I have a legendary gold broadsword. Um, the damage doesn't change in here. It will show that in the game. That's just because um, that's just because the way, and I'm not sure why, but just the way it works in here. Can't really load all the damage types, and that kind of take a lot. Especially with all the buffs that you have on your items, stuff like that. But anyways, so once you're all done changing up your inventory, uh, you can go ahead and just click save. As you can see right here, it will download it. And then what you do is you, um, I think I have the folder. Yeah, okay, I have it all open here. And then... You go ahead and go into your downloads folder, find where it is. Uh, let's see, close out this real quickly. Alright, so then you drag it from your downloads into this file here. Basically, you just go to Documents, My Games, Terraria, Players, and then you go ahead and drag the file inside here. Alright, so now that's in here, I'm going to be right back and open up Terraria. Alright, so I am back in, I am in Terraria with the character I changed, and uh, first of all, as you can see, I had the legendary gold broadsword, and it's still really bad, but um, basically, everything in this character, almost everything, like the armor, uh, the, this stuff right here, accessories, all this stuff basically is all spawned in with this mod, um, so yeah, um, also, it did, not, it did not change the health Unfortunately, if you could, that would be amazing, but unfortunately, no, that's not how it works, so. but yeah, it's still cool that there's a possibility that the thing will happen. And sorry about the cast, let me just go ahead. Alright, a little bit quieter over here, and yeah, so that is that. Um, so yeah, a uh, link to this uh, website will be in the description below. And uh, yeah, so thank you so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out my website and my Twitter. All links to last up in the description below. And once again, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. See you guys later.